Well, joining us now to discuss the Supreme Court's decision on DACA is a local DACA recipient, Daniela Carvajal of Boston. Thanks so much for coming on the show. We appreciate it. Hey, thank you for having me. You were born in Colombia. You came here with your parents when you were just two years old. You got DACA protection in 2012, but of course you've been living with the uncertainty ever since. So how did you react when this ruling came down today? When I got the news, I was re instantly relieved, um, very joyful and kind of in shock because um, this is a victory for all, all the young people like me who have been in this country working, going to school, contributing to our communities and just trying to fight for better um, situations for the entire immigrant community. Well, President Trump suggested today, as I'm sure you've heard, that he will try to start this process over, that he will still try to revoke your protections. So does today's decision actually make you feel safer at the end of the day? It does make me feel safer because I think that, at least for the moment, I'm not going to be worried about the possibility of being deported and separated from my family. And I think it also gives me and all the other people protected by DACA um, just more strength to continue fighting. And now more than ever, it's really important for us to push for a permanent protection that's going to protect us, the, the DREAMers, as well as our entire community. You are one of about 6,000 DACA recipients here in Massachusetts, more than 600,000 across the country. Critics of the program will say that it incentivizes undocumented immigration, and some of them argue that you should be deported. What is your response to them? Well, I think that definitely they're wrong. Um, the, a lot of people that have DACA didn't really have a choice when they came to this country. Uh, we just want to contribute to our community and, and be able to continue to contribute to our community because for a lot of us, it's really the only country we've known as a home. Well, Daniela Carvajal, thank you so much for joining us. It's very nice to meet you. Thank you. It was nice meeting you too.